she was hot cotton. You yeah. always want to talk, but okay, you don't want to listen. Excuse is not an option. You got to fight for it. If you ain't making money, ain't making sense. Well, thank you, but I'm done. When you make this kind of money, you cannot walk around, sweetie, looking like platypus. So what's up with a menage and twirl? Are you serious for real? I know how to bring the heat when I feel like it. The relationship with Dorothy um, has developed, I believe, uh, in the point it was intended. I got what I needed um, from her. Uh, she's, she's coached me. She's taught me a lot. She was high cotton. She had a beautiful home, uh, drove expensive cars. I started off as a copywriter, um, and I learned a lot of great skills, people skills, customer service. I actually went to talk to her about doing an ad. Oh, God, she must have talked for days how, what she wouldn't do it and how much money I make. I can do this for you and I can do that. I said, okay, now let me tell you about what I do. You may think you know everything, and you may not know a lot more than some people, mm -hmm. but I think I've got a few years on you. And the best thing about advice is you don't have to take it. Me having a corporate background uh, in marketing, I felt compelled to help her because um, she would always walk around saying she doesn't know about this and she doesn't know about that. So she appeared to be quite incompetent. Dorothy, you yes. always want to talk, but okay, you don't want to listen. Talk. I am a professional, motivational and I'm speaker. And I'm a I'm a I don't know what the hell you yeah. are. It's kind of hard sometimes to coach her, but the times that we did get together and have intimate times, uh, she would acknowledge that, you know, hell, if it was not for you, uh, my business would not have involved. I'm grateful, you know, for that acknowledgement, but that's in private. Uh, sometime when we get in front of the leaders, it can be a different spin. I'm gonna still, I may not always be right, <laughs> but I'm gonna still be your mom. But you gotta respect that I have an opinion as well. I I was with her the day she drove off from her job and quit her job. And from that day to this one, Helen has been a person of excitement. Well, you uh, they say you're the godmother, but you're not my mother. So the bottom line then is, don't you call me we gonna do the don't show you this way. I need 45 minutes. Helen's a beast. You better watch it. Okay, because the beast will consume you if you get weak around you know, Maybe I am too aggressive. Maybe I do need to tone it down some. But you a man. You a manly man. So you should be able to take whatever I give. When Ella's around, I eat my Wheaties. If you keep on down the path that you want, I'm going to I ain't going to have you back. Thank you, but I'm done. I mean, you don't get too much after this. Watch Helen on the Amateur Millionaire Club. The new Get Rich Reality Show. Sunday nights, 10.30 p.m. on MyATL.